how to start this. I'm dyslexic. Um, I'm, I'm kind of fundamentally challenged with language, or language fundamentally challenges me in many ways. Um, and the dyslexia makes it so that I'm, I've always been, and I'm continuously aware of the physical nature of language. And not only the physical nature of language is on the page, but in my head. So it's, you know, it's, there's a, the body and the land, my, my body and my experience of language is, they're, they're inextricably linked. And, you know, so what you're going to be talking about with like, you know, the body um, and how language is always instantiated and you know, embodied by a person. I, 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 I'm, this is great stuff. Um, uh, whatever that means, you know, it's, it's, uh, it's, it's, it's good stuff. Um, I was just thinking about it so while, while you guys were talking. I was thinking about how over my life I've operated in English, Spanish, Arabic, Sub-Saharan French, Mandinka, Russian, and German. I'm not comfortable in any of them. <laughs> you know? Okay, so, so, there, so there's, I'm, I'm always uncomfortable with language. I hide it a lot, but I, I am. And one of the things that I like to do with my writing is make other people uncomfortable with language. <laughs> I mean, I gotta live with this every day, so. You guys. You know? Okay, but, so, what this project is, is it's, um, Translinations is, um, I've been working on it, like Chris said, since the mid 90s. I think I, I can't remember whether, whether I started in 94, 95, something like that. And I've, I variously kind of talk about it as I'm, I'm, I'm letting Emma, Emily Dickinson you know, have the, 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 the language that she really wanted when she you know, was trying to write. Which she couldn't, she couldn't do it, you know, because for various reasons, you know, sexist time, and wouldn't let her use the right words. Um, so I'll, I'll read a couple, and then, then we'll, I'll talk a little bit more. So I'm going to start with one. This, this one's from Mike Bozinski, because he likes, he likes it. Mike, Mike, you. Okay, I'm having one of those dyslexic moments. We'll, we'll go through this here. Well, maybe this isn't the one that went. <laughs> I mean, like, I'm totally, I'm, I'm not totally like this dysfunctional. Uh, my dyslexia gets worse when I'm tired. Okay, no. so there we go. And I'm like really tired. Which what? Which, which one is it? Which, which the the Yeti one. Five fifty. No, five fifty is the wrong Yeti one. Oh. Is it five fifty? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, five. Okay, I got it. I got it. Okay, cool. Well, so <laughs> right, um, okay, so five ninety one. <laughs> Tower parapet hissy bellow flan. These underoos clot pillow. LTDs oft splat most fear, and evening these know. Mm. Leaves fall, coughs pecks, strike vacuous toy. Sty erect liam hissy, blood clots so touch aster furnished bed. Fussy myth travesty. Isis toast emulate their girth, end scandalized these pee, end blind gastronomy simplex. Yeti anti-gassing cry. <laughs> There's the Yeti. <laughs> Yeti anti-gassing cry. Blood clean cower elves. Tuppence fear. Asthma tubist glee. Flat brides. Omits at blunder. A-bomb. Toe jam crustify. That's what Dickinson was trying to write. 
but she couldn't really quite get it done. Um, one of the things that I like about what Dickinson was trying to do was that there's, there's really an amazing wealth of fantastic, phasm phantasmagoric creatures. Um, um, and, and at least in this section, there are lots of elves of various kinds. Um, some of them, well, the elves are, uh, there's a, a shit elf, um, there's a mice elf, there's a sty elf, um, and, and, and I'm really, I, I don't really know what these elves are. Um, there's a, I mean, the shit elf might be an elf made out of shit, or it might be a, an elf that lives in shit. Um, I'm pretty sure that the mice elves are elves that herd mice. But that might not be very good. Okay, so 580. Agave, mice elf, to end hook, stems elf, foreplay. These alum contact offal knife, water, catalyzed, piss day. Few health fight deuce apartment, mice shelf apiary reprove. Flan cyst freight surplus for drug sect. <coughs> that bailey frown cough glare. Deprecate thieve mission butyl. Them ungents cry. Shill stable in the piles of lice. Bees turtle fungoid cry. Fat beast bismuth duel frisk. Dome ground flu dual blame. Bleat pet oval knife. Beach fright toe. Gin involved, fevery spoon. Five seventy one. Thrust buffalo, a cost torso, couldn't thigh, pest flute, <coughs> ease way, cut, pounce assault, ordinance pre flight. Aspic liver's dolt, ass stalag uptight, <laughs> acorn, mandrill, were cad cordless. Oh, there's another one of those fantastic creatures. Right? There are a bunch of lycanthropes here too. So a were cad, three days a month, you know. Were <laughs> <laughs> cake. Were cakes are yeah. That. The were cakes are good too. The were cakes have a really you know the, the, the people who are, who are were cakes. I really don't like June. <laughs> okay. Acorn mandrill, werecad cordless, cup rice, jizz, spavenestes trace, powder cord, fop dough, astral glance, toupee lacrosse. Another nice thing about this kind of this kind of work is that if I mess up, you know, with the dyslexia, you guys have no idea. <laughs> um, you know, one of the things that because one, one of the things that happens with, with, with me with my dyslexia is is when I get tired, you know, things kind of move around and I see the wrong word. Okay, that's not such a big deal. But what often what well, what often will happen is I'll see the wrong word not with the letters inter interchanged, but I'll just see the wrong word in, inside of the shape. So it's a, 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 a translation process right there at the moment. And that's one of the things that I use in the composition of this, is I use the shape, the outline of the word, to uh, reflect them through the language, if that makes sense. Mm -hmm. right, so, so I use sound, rhythm, and then the outline of the shape of the word. And it turns out, I mean, I figured this out when I was studying my own weirdness, um, that <laughs> most people it, they end up learning how to read by learning by learning the shapes of words. It's the first letter, the last letter, and the shape of the word. Um, mm. And that's how you get kind of fluent in you know, sort of, sort of a, a, a literacy fluency. Um, and one of the problems with dyslexics is they can't move from they we can't move from <laughs> uh, from from the, the the individual packets of information to the the overall packet. Um, so it's like trees for the forest or stuff. Like um, but anyway, so that's part of how this, this stuff goes through. My mill. What did you, Mike and Mark? You, you you said something about. Do you remember saying something about all the best works of Western literature go through the garbage? 
Yeah, yeah, the microphone. <laughs> yeah, something like that. Well, yeah, that's what it is. Okay, so I'm turning, I'm turning it all into garbage, but it's kind of a nice garbage that I like very much. Um, hmm? They go through it. They go through it, okay. 537. Metrovate, pow. Weaver it out. Mesotopath date, pow. Make hay. Seeds scrupled. Heath biscuit, for opportunity. Their liver leeches, tomain feet, aside, a eared bead rye. Oil over, life cold, and connive hence. My gadget, then able thee, their ever preaches tomain crest. Style, style, <laughs> may in drab ovi, porous claymore, the trireme anal light. <laughs> Duster eco nomize, they'll over. Art, give her sneeches, Tomain mouse. Remember whence she, sweet fry lie, perching eyes, they'll ask. Themselves, where chick? With her? One of the things that, that, that happens when, you know, on this process, this years and years long process, is, is like, like Dickinson, I will do it multiple versions of the same poem. So this one, that was that was one of the first, that was, that poem was first drafted, I think, in like 96, 97. This one was a few years ago. 537A. Weep, trove, sit, brow, doom weaver, pout. Mies, top, top, trove, fit, brow. Shake faced these rubles. Breathe, descent. More hop tuna tent. Fear, shiver, Breaches, tummy beat, hazmat. Ply, tart cedric. Oil over, strife, dead knock, ungents. Shrike breath, enfeeble tree. Fear, shiver, breaches, tummy fest. Krill, krill. Knife bands a glove. Propane, wither, demeaning plight. <coughs> Dust, recon, size, shale glove. Fear, shiver, breaches, tummy south. Dismember. Went Hessa, slept brine, perching flies, shale cast, stem cells, wear tick, wither. Bill, we've got like 10 minutes left in the okay. session. No, that's cool. I'm just that's wondering cool. if we can find a way of opening this out yeah. into a discussion with what Erin and Alana are up to. And then if there are questions, for, I don't want to sh shut you off. I'm just thinking that I'm sure people are also wanting to ask about what's going on here, and the, the discussion is inevitably going to go here, too. Yeah, so, yeah, is that yeah, okay? This is great. So, I, you get to clap twice for me. I'll do one more. Because <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's, it's a short one. 558. Bottle ermine bath surface. Often Gerald sent. Mer clown. Herb duty, <laughs> Hindi glove shed roth, shit elf, yeah. plex habit, vine. Yeah. <laughs>